Today we're taking that tripod and learning how to turn with it. I'm not doing the full head spin today. It is just to demonstrate how to start introducing the turn. Turns on your head can be intimidating. They're just like doing pirouettes, <laughs> but on your head. That being said, we introduce them slowly. You have to find that balance point just like we would have done for a pirouette, but now you're going to shift in smaller intervals. I will go about this two ways. One, being able to lift your knees just a little bit off your elbows. From there, trying to pivot very, very little. We're talking like a 16th of a turn. Like, see if you can even rotate anything. For me, I'm actually right-handed, but I'm left side dominant for most of the things that I do. In the dance world, we need to be able to execute everything on both sides. But when you're first learning some of these things, you do start with your dominant side because it'll make it easier to control with some of the movements we're doing. So when you're first learning these, it's often encouraged that you stick to the side that you are stronger on. So in my case, when I first started learning how to turn on my head, I actually pick up my left side and I rotate clockwise. So that way I am moving into my dominant working side, which is my left side. The other point that I will teach is to not lift your legs. The reason for this is because if you feel that connection going through your entire body and keeping that center, you are able to lift and move as a unit. Some of this comes down to teacher preference. Some of this comes down to how a student needs to learn and feel their body do the rotation. So I, again, will alter which method I use to better have my dancers understand and feel the movement so that we can begin to do it safely. We spend an extensive amount of time doing just these little rotations before we ever even do a full or let alone even try for a quarter rotation because we need to clean up all the steps in between. I will see you tomorrow as we talk about handstands. I will see you then.